All right, before I dig in, I need to take this. I'm going to be making a personal pan pizza since I'm craving for some pizza. I didn't feel like going outside because it's all gray and gloomy. And so since I have some ingredients on hand, I figured why not make it from home? I'll show you guys how I do it and let me know in the comments if you decide to try it out. Let's get started because I'm hungry. In order to make this pizza, you're going to need a few ingredients. You're going to need some pasta sauce. I don't have marinara sauce. So I'm going to use the remaining that's in here. I need to buy some more. I'll be using tortillas. I'm using the protein one. So that's going to be my crust and mozzarella cheese. I don't have pepperoni slices. So for the added protein, I'll be using some ground turkey that I made last night. Okay, let's get started. Got my crust here. Sauce. I don't have too much, but I would say that you can use like, I don't know, maybe, what's half of a, half of a cup? It's huh? that amount. <laughs> so you can use that. This is all I have left, so this looks like probably around four tablespoons of the sauce. So after we the sauce on top of the crust. We're going to spread it evenly on the tortilla like so. The next part is add cheese, mozzarella specifically. I'm gonna go with the serving size, which is a fourth of a cup. Let's get them out. Going to sprinkle it on top. Then I'm going to evenly distribute the cheese. I feel like it needs more cheese. I'm going to add a little more because I like I like my pizza cheesy. So that's a lot of cheese. Hopefully it will come out well. I didn't use that much cheese when I first made it. So let's see how this one turns out. And the next part is optional, but if you want to add some protein, you can go ahead and add like pepperoni slices or sausage, whatever you like, even vegetables. I'm gonna add some ground turkey. Sounds weird, right? But I need some protein. Maybe a little more. All right, I think that's good. That's what it looks like. Bruh. I know it's not the most aesthetically pleasing thing, but trust me, it's gonna taste good. I'm gonna to try to do this carefully so none of the toppings spill. <laughs> Let's see, oh, like this maybe. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. That's what she looks like. Time to put her in the microwave oven. Okay, now that it's in the oven, we're going to set it to 250 and then I'll do 10 minutes. While that's happening, I should tidy up and maybe I'll play the game for a bit to kill some time. All right, before I dig in, I need to take this because I love pizza, I love dairy, all of that, ice cream, you name it, but I get bloated and so I don't want to feel like that. I still want to enjoy the things that I love and so this is really handy. All right, I'll start with the first slice. Slice number one, here we go. Mm. Got a cheese pull too. This is actually better with more cheese. It's actually not bad with the ground turkey. It gives it a little more something to it, you know. Mmm. Mmm, good. It definitely fulfills that pizza craving. I know it's not the same, but think of it this way. You're saving money. It's easy to make. It's quick, and the fourth thing is, it's guilt-free. Mm. 
Next time I make this, I want to get pepperoni slices for sure. Mm. Mm. I'm a pepperoni lover. So that's how you make a personal tortilla pizza. Curious to know if you guys have done this before. I did it out of curiosity because I really wanted pizza not long ago and so I just made do with whatever I got and I came up with it and it's pretty decent. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below in the comments if you're going to try this and what you came up with, like maybe different toppings and recipes. Have fun with it. I'm going to crush this pizza right now and that will be it. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.